Hey, so we are at Columbus Flea Market today. Um, it's Sunday. We're going to go uh, do a little bit of shopping. The market's not super busy, but it'll be interesting to see what we find. All right. So it's the first true day that it's below zero. You can see how empty uh, the market is today. Since there's no wind, it, it's going to be a good day if you were a vendor to set up. You can probably make some money, but it's just always a cold start. So, all right, we'll see if we find anything. What do you get on your bottles? I got the piece. Dollar each on bottles. I think I'll get that one. She wanted two dollars on the Parker pen. So that's three. My mom would like the turtles. I don't know. This guy has some cool insulators. Some other stuff. I think, I think I'm going to get this spring sign. He said uh, 15 bucks. I always like when they show all the different types of... Definitely cool. Do you have change of a 20? Right, I just want to see if there's anything else I need. Ooh. What do you get on the sliders? These things, Jim, have been selling real well. Yeah. I was surprised. Good morning. Good morning. The ones in the front are a dollar each? Okay. I just bought uh, from Lambertville, I'll have to show you guys, uh, probably 8,000 of those for, that was a couple hundred bucks, but it's amazing how many I got, so I don't know. If you guys want me to show you, I will. Let me know. Well, the regular section has a lot of people. I, uh, I just bought a couple of pewter plates. How much are your cans? Cans? That guy has two bucks. I bet Ben would like that. I always trade well with him on old cans. 
How about this one? Two bucks. Oh. I think I might leave the grease. It's because it's kind of full. Good old advertising stuff, though. Next spot. Yeah, I've been playing sh shopping instead of setting up. I not not in this pattern to make it the solid. It's got a lot of neat stuff. It's called the frog. No, that's the model. I've got it down to one storage unit. So, how much was this guy originally? Originally, what's your guess? Thirty-four hundred dollars. Look at the year too. You're gonna try it at auction? Nineteen eighty-nine. I'll talk to you later. Oh, this is from Trenton Gallery. Is it bronze? No, it's porcelain. I wish it was bronze. It'd be a lot easier to sell. Yeah. No, it just looked like a bronze. So I just bought this box of marbles for five bucks. It's pretty cool. Is she sold? No. Pretty creepy. Alright, next box. Yeah, I see the shadow. <laughs> ah, the shadow knows. How about this guy? You got a boner? Yep, got a boner. Call her one a boner. Got a lot of neat little stuff. That's an early football mask. How much is the football helmet? Uh, 15. I guess it's got a lot of tape on it. <laughs> yeah. That's a big deal, Dean. Yeah. I, I'm going to get that, I think. It's pretty, definitely different. I'm just seeing if you have anything else I truly need. Finding some stuff today. Nothing out of this world. Oh, the lady ended up giving me the sticker when I was leaving. I guess I'll put it on the bus. It's always good to get something for free. <laughs> Almost looks silver, right? <laughs> How much is the pasta maker, Dan? The pasta maker. If you need it, you can have it. What happened with you? This is a. Were you cold? No, I'm 
butt to make people laugh. <laughs> people kept saying I was always angry, so I figured... The, the Grinch was a good one? Yeah. I, I could, uh... I could see why you wear it. <laughs> he does yell more than most people. So we're thinking of doing... Griswold number eight, that's nice and clean too. It's nice that it's got the lid. Yeah. What do you get on the cast iron pot? What do you want? It's good buy. It's nice. You never they're always missing the lids. Oh, it's you. Yeah. 65 for you. Oh, it's... The lids are fine. That's what I was just saying. Can't tell if it's old. I went to Lambertville yesterday. Somebody gave me three chairs. Uh -huh. As they were leaving, I sold one chair for five bucks. That's all I sold all day. Oh, here today? No, Lambertville. Yesterday. Oh, that sucks. Well, you know it was, why it's good though? I got there late and I didn't pay the rent. <laughs> it was super windy though yesterday. Yeah, and that's why I went there because usually if it's horrible like that, that's the only place that they're, um, you know, some people still come around. I'm talking about the yep. well, they came out. Well, I'm heading there now. I'll, I'll see you later. To set up or shot? Camera keeps on crapping out, but just wanted to show you her uh, Pyrex real fast. You got some really nice, uh, oh, you got Fire King too. Yeah. It's very pretty. But I was I was thinking this this was really neat. I've never seen the Sunkiss label. It's awesome. Oh, this is Sunkiss. Yeah, I know. Um, thank you. And I have a blue one, too. She was holding my stuff. Normally buys a lot of my glassware. Um, I did buy the springs. We'll see you guys at, uh, home, and I'll show you what we picked up. Hey, everybody. So I made it back home. I am, uh, going to show you what I got at Columbus, uh, today. Let's see. First box, or first bag was... Oh yeah, the I thought it said uh, brewing, but I guess not. I mean, it's definitely a beer bottle, but I I kind of like the ones that say uh, brewing company. I think the reason I bought it for the it was cheap, but the reason I bought it was because it had the ceramic cap. Um, I thought this was a Parker pen, uh, but it, I mean, it's a fountain pen. It's a wherever fountain pen. The Parker case isn't bad, though. I think I might be able to sell the Parker case in a, in a lot of Parker stuff, and I should be able to sell the pen by itself. I wonder if it's got a, nah, it's not a gold, gold nib, but it's a nice clean pen. Um, I didn't get this on camera, but these, these are really cool. They are a ton of magnets. Must have been from like a school or, they're not really that strong, but still kind of fun. The... Oh, yeah, lady sold me these. So these go on your bumper of your car. Uh, they are 50 cents each, is what she sold them to me for. Uh, I was real happy about that. I got I got all she had for uh, six bucks. I think this should sell online fairly well. Um, bought the Scout's Oath. Um... That was a dollar from the same lady. I did find a pewter. The guy asked seven dollars for the two or the three plates. I got them for five. Um, I like these because I can sell these fairly well at uh, Columbus, the early uh, Hallmark computer, Hallmark computer. Um, 
you don't get a lot of that but it does come that's probably from uh it's just dinnerware but it's gotta gotta be over 100 years old probably almost 200 um oh yeah the, the guy who uh sold me the wire or the the sign with the uh, the springs he chart he gave me the solder he only charged me 15 bucks for that uh that board i think that's pretty pretty great i definitely have a thing for springs i don't know why um oh I ended up getting the grease can. And this can for $3 for the pair. Actually, I bought that from the person who I got the Star Wars uh, decals from. So, I think that was a really good buy. I'll look them up later. I don't know enough about oil cans and uh, and or grease cans. So five bucks I bought this off of my friend. It's got a bunch of a uh, bunch of little plastic train parts, but the reason I wanted it was oh, there's even some cool little cars in here. Here's a tow truck. I didn't see those. Looks like uh, four and a half metal cars. <laughs> we got some plastic ones too. Little tractor. But the reason I bought all this was for the for the marbles. A couple cat's eyes and stuff in here. So I thought. Five dollars, it seemed like a good buy. With the little metal cars, it definitely made back my money. There's a forklift for Darwin. He used to really love forklifts when he was little. Um, this is all my free stuff. A friend of mine who I hadn't seen in a while gave me all these uh, bottles of uh, bottles and cans of hardware um, I didn't realize there was a whistle on this one so I'm going to pour some of them out because it looks like there's some real interesting things the skeleton keys I like the little drain plug these corner brackets, you always use those. I was really wondering if these screws in here, or these little brads, uh, tacks, if they were steel or not. It's starting to, I think they might be. Maybe not. Uh, yeah, I think they are. Let's see, we'll take a, take a little handful of them out. Some are and some aren't. The short ones are not. The short ones are all brass. This one's longer. That's uh, so. I guess I have to go through a with a magnet and just pull out the ones that are steel. But all these short ones in my hand are definitely definitely brass. The magnet's not picking them up. So that's really cool. I got this this big spring and a bunch of keys. I don't know. I have a bunch. I have a lot of keys. Uh, they do sell by by weight online, but every once in a while you'll find something that has some weird uh, business name or something like that on it, and it does. Uh, I've done 15, 20 bucks on one single key before. 
there's all these brass parts in this. I always like the handles. Oh, and this was probably the weirdest thing that was in all those bins. All these vintage razor blades. Definitely. Definitely kind of neat. Could either make a lot, like all the different brands, and try them online, but somebody saved tons and tons and tons of razors. Maybe he worked at a barber shop where it's just 20 years of shaving. But I don't know. I, I really enjoyed all these uh, cool little vials of brass screws and stuff. So thank you, George. Um, and the best thing I think I got was this football helmet. Uh, I really like the face guard. Uh, that tape will come off. I, I'm probably not going to mess with it because the maker's name's in there anyway. It's got the... It was Tony's helmet. But it's probably uh, early 50s, late 40s, somewhere in there. Very cool. So, it's between that and the springboard for what's worth the most money out of what I got. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you like it, please let me know. I'll uh, definitely uh, do some more of these. Alright, peace.